Hi everyone, my name is Melissa Bender. Welcome to my workout of the day. Today is day 11 of week two of our six week workout challenge. Is that enough numbers, guys? <laughs> okay, so for today, we are going to be interspersing 30 seconds of cardio burst. So I'm gonna do high knees, you could do jump rope, you can do marching in place, you could do anything, just focus on keeping your heart rate up and keeping your pace moving. Um, and we're going to do arms and back. So I have dumbbells and I have a chair for this workout. If you don't have a chair, don't worry about it. You can do these movements from the floor, the ones that I do seated, okay? You guys are ready? My baby is watching us work out, so if you hear little coos and, and talking, that's Maverick. Okay, he usually falls asleep by the end, but we'll see. He might wanna to talk to you guys too. Um, okay, let's get started. So first we're going to start with our 30 seconds of cardio. Here we go. Breathe. If you're doing high knees, core pulls in, knees go high. We're going to be sitting in the chair for the next move or on the floor. Good job, guys. Keep that core engaged as you drive those knees high. Okay, for the next move, use your chair. We're gonna do an L sit. Or as close to an L as we can get, because I don't think my core muscles are there yet. Hands press into the seat of the chair or into the floor, and you're gonna lift your butt off of the chair. Hold. And you can try and extend. I'm not there yet though. Belly muscles pull in tight. And keep breathing. So it's just a lift and a hold. Try not to drop. If you do, it's okay. Come right back up. Three, two, one. Cardio. We're going to be in the chair for the next one too. But we're going to be using our dumbbells for the next exercise. Breathe and keep moving. Okay, so for the next one, shoulder press, seated. If you want to, you can sit cross-legged for this one. Grab your dumbbells, hold them at either side of your shoulders, press up, and then bring it down. As you come down, squeeze your shoulder blades together. Core stays engaged the whole time. Breathe. Control your up and down parts of the motion. Okay. Cardio burst. Can you get rid of the chair for now? I'll keep breathing it again. Breathe. Push the pace a little bit if you can. we have a warrior row right so we're going to extend our right foot into a warrior three core stays tight hip and knee toward the ground we're going to bring that weight i'll show you on the other side so you can see to the outside edge of your rib cage so i'm doing right leg left arm straight line from head to hips to heel keep rowing Flat back is the focus here. Really challenging ourselves with this one to keep the balance. Good job. 
cardio, and then same thing on the other side. So I'll do left leg, right arm next. Right into it. Good job, keep moving. Really making those arms work. Okay, cardio. Okay, next we have a lunge and curl, right side first. So we're going to reverse lunge, step back, curl, stand. So elbow stays tucked at the side, core stays tight. I'll turn to show you guys the movement. Big step back. Elbow stay still. Good job, guys. Keep breathing. Okay, cardio burst. Doing great, guys. Good job. We're going to have the other side next. No slacking, keep it pushing. Okay. Other side. Reverse lunge left or whatever side you didn't just do. Belly stays tight, curl. Good job, keep breathing. Don't forget to keep the 
core engaged. Ten seconds left. Okay, cardio. We're going to be on the mat for the next exercise. push-up. So we're going to lay on our right side first. Bottom arm reaches around your rib cage to hug. Core stays tight. Push through the palm and feel the back of the arm engage as you lift. Hand is in front of your chest and use the arm muscles to lift and to lower. Okay, so I can pick up the pace a little bit. I'm slacking. I catch myself sometimes. Good job, guys. Keep moving. Cardio. And then we're going to lay on the other side and get the other arm. engagement in this in this arm good job guys keep going dropping the weight. So even if you can't tap it all the way down, bring it close. Knees pressing open. Bring it to the shoulder before you press it up. Good job, guys. Okay. That is one round of today's workout. As always, you can repeat it. The number of times I go through it, plus the suggested cardio, will all be posted on my blog. Um, today's workout should be paired with easy cardio, so 30 minutes, comfortable chatting pace, uh, whether it's walking, running, jump rope, swimming, cycling, whatever you want. <laughs> Just get your body moving a little bit more. And like I said, you can repeat this one if you're up for it. As always, the breakdown plus the rest of the 
six week workout challenges that are up so far and over 700 other free workouts are on my site, benderfitness.com. So click like if you like the workout, click subscribe if you wanna keep getting free workouts and comment, let me know how you're doing, how you're feeling, um, what you think of the challenge so far, or even what you're having trouble with. I'll be reading them, I'll be looking for the comments. I will see you guys tomorrow with a new workout. Bye.